I'm my lady, you're my butterfly, sugar, baby. Broadcasting live. 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 Broadcasting live. Across the Philippines and around the planet. This is the world famous Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. We make your day happier. <laughs> magic 89.9. The magic brings you closer to the biggest artists. Coldplay. Kanye West. Dua Lipa. Bruno Mars. Harry Styles, Chainsmokers, and more. Somebody scream! We bring you to where it's happening. We are Magic 89.9. From our homes to around the world, this is Magic 89.9. Amazing. The Magic Pop 30. We count to down the 30 hottest songs of the week. Find out which artists that are lit AF. AF. As Zoe and Ashley count it down from 30 to 1. The Magic Pop 30. Are you ready? Now on its new time slot. Thursdays, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. On today's best music. Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. The seats you want for the movies you love. This is Sparta! Action. Right. I am Iron Man. Drama. She was more real than anything I've ever known. Suspense. Don't push the button. Don't push the button. Horror. Horror. I need you to call 911. It doesn't matter. Comedy. Are you hurt? Yeah, not, not since I was 10. Free passes and easy access to the big screen. Every day. How did you burn? I know. Be the first to watch the greatest movies on planet Earth. Today's blockbuster is on the magic. This is RBO, your radio box office station. Stop the virus, not the music. Magic 89.9. We'll be singing. An old favorite just got better. I get no time. A new sound. Even in my heart. A new vibe. Just hit me with the truth. A new energy. Do you have the time? A new Friday man. Never said you were pretending. The same gold standard of music. Now, now, in a new package. The nicest of the, the nicest 90s. of the nineties and the early two thousands. Coming, coming to you every Friday. Every Friday. Twenty four hours of yesterday's hits today. Friday madness. Exclusively on the station that gives you the most complete radio experience. Magic eighty nine point nine. Come, my lady, come, come, my lady, you're my butterfly, sugar. Live across the Philippines and around the planet. This is the world famous Magic 89.9. Home of today's best music. Today's best music. The best music ever. The best music ever. On air, online, and on ground. Are you ready? The black and yellow microphone is on. Music. Magic 89.9. We make your day happier. <laughs> Magic 89.9. The Magic brings you closer to the biggest artists. Coldplay. Kanye West. Dua Lipa. Bruno Mars. Harry Styles, Chainsmokers, and more. Somebody scream! We bring you to where it's happening. We are Magic 89.9. From our homes to around the world, this is Magic 89.9. Amazing. 
The Magic Pop 30. We count down the 30 hottest songs of the week. Find out which artists that are lit AF. AF. As Zoe and Ashley count it down from 30 to 1. The Magic Pop 30. Are you ready? Now on its new time slot. Thursdays, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. On today's best music. Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9 The seats you want for the movies you love. This is Sparta! Action. Right. I am Iron Man. Drama. She was more real to me than anything I've ever known. Suspense. Don't push the button. Don't push the button. Horror. I need you to call 911. It doesn't matter. Comedy. Are you hurt? Yeah, not, not since I was 10. Free passes and easy access to the big screen. Every day. How did you burn? No. Be the first to watch the greatest movies on planet Earth. Today's blockbuster is on the magic. This is RBO, your radio box office station. Stop the virus, not the music. Magic 89.9. We'll be singing. An old favorite just got better. I get no time. A new sound. Even in my heart. A new vibe. Just hit me with the truth. A new energy. Do you have the time? A new Friday madness. You never said you were pretending. The same gold standard of music. Now, now, in a new package. The nicest of the, the nicest 90s. of the nineties and the early two thousands. Co- coming, coming to you every Friday. Every Friday. Twenty four hours of yesterday's hits today. Friday madness. Exclusively on the station that gives you the most complete radio experience, Magic 89.9. Broadcasting live. Live. Broadcasting live. Across the Philippines and around the planet. This is the world famous Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. We make your day happier. (laughs) Magic 89.9. The magic brings you closer to the biggest artists. Coldplay. Kanye West. Dua Lipa. Bruno Mars. Harry Styles, Chainsmokers, and more. Somebody scream! We bring you to where it's happening. We are Magic 89.9. From our homes to around the world, this is Magic 89.9. Amazing. The Magic Pop 30. We count down the 30 hottest songs of the week. Find out which artists that are lit AF. AF. As Zoe and Ashley count it down from 30 to 1. The Magic Pop 30. Are you ready? Now on its new time slot. Thursdays, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. On today's best music. Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. The seats you want for the movies you love. This is Sparta! Action! Right. I am Iron Man. Drama. She was more real to me than anything I've ever known. Suspense. No, don't push the button! Don't! don't push Horror. Horror. I need you to call 911. It doesn't matter! Comedy. Right. Are you hurt? Yeah, not, not since I was 10. Free passes and easy access to the big screen. Every day. How did you burn? No! Be the first to watch the greatest movies on planet Earth. Today's blockbuster is on the magic. This is RBO, your radio box office station. Stop the virus, not the music. Magic 89.9. We'll be singing. An old favorite just got better. I get no time. A new sound. Even in my heart. A new vibe. Just hit me with the truth. A new energy. Do you have the time? A new Friday madness. Never said you were pretending 
the same gold standard of music. Now, now, now in a new package, the nicest of the, the nicest 90s. of the nineties and the early two thousands Co coming coming to you every Friday, every Friday. 24 hours of yesterday's hits today. Friday Madness. Exclusively on the station that gives you the most complete radio experience. Magic 89.9. Come my lady, come, come my lady. You're my butterfly. Sugar, baby. Broadcasting live. 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 Broadcasting. Broadcasting live. Across the Philippines and around the planet. This is the world famous Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. We make your day happier. <laughs> magic 89.9. The magic brings you closer to the biggest artists. Coldplay. Kanye West. Dua Lipa. Bruno Mars. Harry Styles, Chainsmokers, and more. Somebody scream! We bring you to where it's happening. We are Magic 89.9. From our homes to around the world, this is Magic 89.9. Amazing. The Magic Pop 30. We count to down the 30 hottest songs of the week. Find out which artists that are lit AF. AF. As Zoe and Ashley count it down from 30 to 1. The Magic Pop 30. Are you ready? Now on its new time slot. Thursdays, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. On today's best music. Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. The seats you want for the movies you love. This is Sparta! Action. Right. I am Iron Man. Drama. She was more real to me than anything I've ever known. There is an echo. Yeah, it's, okay. it's awful. No, it's I only think, because uh, you forgot to mute your, your other Zoom. Yeah, mute your Zoom. Yeah. There you go. C A L S. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Thora looks the part, but has never. <laughs> is it okay now? Am I good? You're yeah, very the soft. Is yeah. really I bad too. Mic, mic up. Can you put up your mic volume, up. Dara? How about now? More. <laughs> and stop whispering. <laughs> no, my mic is. <laughs> my mic is max. You're like a Resorts World commercial. <laughs> <laughs> my mic is max. <laughs> It's at 10, 10 and a half. <laughs> ASMR. Oh, wow. that's weird. Is that the highest? Yeah, that's Higher the highest. Pa. Higher pa. I'm going to max it out. Yes. There. Yes. Max it out. There you go. There. Oh, you like mm. this? You like this? Yeah. yeah. Hey, oh, this not just like, we need it. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the show. It is a Tuesday morning. The oh, guys, I missed us. Of June. I, I know I missed you guys. I'm sorry. You know, I had to take a little bit of time off. Uh, I think uh, many of you guys knew what happened to uh, our family. Um mm -hmm. A couple of weeks ago with some construction and all that stuff that led to my uh, dog's um, theft and murder, <laughs> yeah, I guess is the way to put oh it. Um, oh. it's, been, it's been rough. I mean, obviously, it's been a rough uh, time for us because, uh, you know, as, as a, as some, I guess, dog lovers in general, they, they kind of treat uh, animals as, as family members. Yes. I, I think, I think you mean that somewhat loosely in a sense that well, I don't know. I mean, then you you love your dogs. I mean, obviously, I can say like I you know his our our dog Bamboo. His name is Kuya to the kids. You call him Kuya. Mm -hmm. Kuya Bamboo. Mm -hmm. So the, you know that it was just more than just an animal. Yeah. But um, you know, I, I think it's in moments like this also that I realize as much as it was like an, uh, an a family member, you then are able to. And this sounds really bad, but I don't know. Maybe it's, I've thought it out too much. But my response is different than if it were a family member. Like, obviously, I want these guys to hurt, and I want, you know, and I'll never get tired of wanting to dish out pain and rage and all of that stuff. But I noticed that I didn't do anything violent about it as if it were a family member in that sense. 
because, uh, well, uh, especially because I'm here. But when I speak to Bina Saya, probably would have, you know, <laughs> would have been easier. <laughs> yeah, no, it really, it, honestly, and, and and that's kind of the thing that I tell everybody when people ask me, "Hey, are you okay?" and all that stuff. I say the same thing. I wish we were home. I wish I was home. Mm. And and that that's kind of weird because it's the thing we hated most. For example, about our last president, right? Is put the law in your hand, in your own hands, <laughs> something like that. But I would have, you know, I would have. Uh, I understand. Easily, yeah, Save the man. No problem. Yeah. yeah. You know what so I wish about it more? No, no, no. Death to your perpetrators. Yeah, no, but the, the thing is, like, you know, people throw the word karma and injustice, and mm-hmm. those words are not in my vocabularies. You know, karma's not in my vocabulary yeah. anyway, yeah, but, yeah. but neither is justice, neither is um, you know, my, my, my vocabulary is revenge, right? The, the pain, mm-hmm. suffering, like, the, the, oh those God. are the words that I, that I tend to. So you honest. Know, Kind of, those are the words I kind of use, right? Not, not justice or not, you know, makakarma kayo. You know, that's not. I, I, I like it. I like a little bit more, you know, umph to it. Yeah, but anyway, I, yeah, right? Yeah, I know. I, and funny, I use the word ugly. I used it against them when I was talking to them. I said, let's just get ugly. Because I'm not the type to do the. You're not going to get a lawsuit, paperwork from me, and you know, all these things that the Americans say. Oh, you got to. You have to file a lawsuit. Like that's not my. That's not my gig. Mm-hmm. I go. I like the ugliness. I go. Let's just get ugly, please. And um, no, fortunately, they didn't do the ugly. Wait, 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 um, so where are we now? Is there? Have you let it any- go? Yeah, I mean, I, it's funny because, again, I, I, I almost didn't want to talk about it because I know it's just not part of our show, right? Our show is supposed to be like, hey, well, yeah. you, know, that's um, you know, there's a, there's a case and, and, you know, it's being investigated by, it's, it's not a case that I've put, it's, you know, it's a criminal case. So you have to, the, you know, the law just does the law, the, you know, it does its thing. Mm-hmm. Um, I am still kind of wondering how do I explain it to my children? Uh, they have no, they don't know about it. In, in fact, Lucas, yesterday we were just walking in the mall, and he started crying kind of uncontrollably for out of the blue. So it's his birthday today, and I didn't want to kind of just compound all of the yeah. the uh, the bad news with mm-hmm. you know the good news and and everything being his birthday. So um, yeah, I mean that's where I am personally. I've been told him yet. Probably next week we'll tell him. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm supposed to pick up the body uh, today. I don't know if I could do that. Like I'm not sure I'm even <laughs> capable of doing that and if you don't pick it up you know they just put it in a mask sound like a mass grave okay, and then you get it then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you have to put it yeah. i have to but it adds a bit of finality and yeah, really no. with it yeah. i'm scared of I, i've never been in a situation like this before so it's weird because i don't want to pick him up because i don't want it to be real yeah. but who am i kidding it's real so i'm in this weird you know i've got 10 days to claim the body and we're at day number three and i'm like okay i've got a couple more days you know, and, and everybody's like, well, are you kidding me? Go get it. I'm like, but you don't know. Like, you don't understand. Mm-hmm. It's, it's weird. Um, I see, you know, I see him. He's not a dirty dog. He's never been a dirty dog. He's been inside dog, so he's clean. And then when you see the pictures, it's kind of like in the movies when you have to identify the body. Yeah. And you see him, you know, you've never seen your dog like that before. It's very difficult. Um, kind of like if you ever saw a loved one before, like, you know, the, you know them at their best. And yes. then if they ever were a victim of a heinous crime, you see them in a in a very unrecognizable state it doesn't feel real so that's why i don't want to you know kind of pick him up in that sense but anyway i'll get to it anyway uh, you know let's not talk about this <laughs> let's talk about that dora's outfit sad <laughs> what's wrong with you dora? why are you dressed like that that's what you, you you it's funny because there could be no different get up between ryan and dora right now <laughs> ryan is in the province uh right you look my boy over here <laughs> i mean right i consider you I mean, I don't know how Tisoy feature you are in person because mm. I've never met you. Or maybe I have, sorry. But, you know, you know what I mean. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. I don't think I've ever met you. And I, I could see maybe Dora becoming red if Dora goes out into the sun, you know, in the beach and all that. Ako, ako yung, ako yung, I have the street kid tan. Yung gray. <laughs> Medyo gray. Medyo pa gray. Yeah. I turn gray. Right? Uh, but, you know, I... I thought maybe Ryan, you turn gray, mm-hmm. but you're a little lobstery. Uh, oh, yeah. what 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 is I well, what's going on here? Why is your face red? Um, I came from the beach. Actually, like day one wasn't so bad, but day two we had to take an hour boat to the place. Yeah, and there was no roof, so the sun was like straight to my face. 
So my nose is red. As soon as I got the bakolod, my titas were like, "Oh, si you know, si Rudolph." It's like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you for that. I've never turned red in my life. Ever once, I've never been red. It's just mm-hmm. brown or gray, and <laughs> I'm kind of jealous because, parang, you know, I, I think I've 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 the economic status to turn red. <laughs> <laughs> Then do you turn red too when you ano, get Yeah, I turn red. Well, oh, kid, yeah, you're 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 you're, 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 you're <laughs> so you're gonna turn red. But you know, guys like me, and I thought Ryan and I were in the same boat here, but apparently not. Yes, you're alone. <laughs> I'm alone in this. Where's the grays at? Come on, great <laughs> lives matter. You know, what? <laughs> this is going to be inappropriate. You know? But my 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 cousin also turns gray, like ugly gray, when she yeah, yeah. And she what's, got, the, she, what's the name of her cousin? That's the Leanne, Leanne. Oh, you said it. Alien. Oh, she's Alien, Ugly now. Grey. Um, <laughs> you know what she used to call the, her, uh, no, her Ugly Grey? She, she used to call it Itim Mahirap. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, what? No, that's what it is. I, I just said it, you're poor Grey, right? Oh. And that's, uh, that's, that's, that's me. That's all yeah, fair stuff. Exactly. <laughs> if, if I turned red, I would, ra- I would probably like the beach more. I think a part of me, my dislike oh, yeah. for the beach is not just the intense heat, it's that I become poor Grey. And um, it's it's Pantone then. It's okay. It's it's in the Pantone. Yeah. It's a color, yeah. yeah it's a color. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Squatter Grey. <laughs> <laughs> happy birthday to our boss. Happy birthday happy to birthday. Boss. Yes. Yes. This is our gift to you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine. By the way, is our phone number if you want to get on the show. God, I would love to hear your voices. I've been on the podcast in forever. I'll get back to that this week. But I missed you guys also on the radio show. If you want to call us, get yourself on air. That would be lovely. Uh, my name is Mo. Of course, that's Stan. That's Dora. That's Ryan. Four of us doing the morning show with you guys. Let's get to a break. When we come back, we'll have a lot of stuff to discuss. Boy, there's so much to talk about. And, of course, your calls to take. Back after this, don't go away. Magic. Thursdays, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. On today's best music. Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9 The seats you want for the movies you love. This is Sparta! Action. Right. I am Iron Man. Drama. She was more real to me than anything I've ever known. Suspense. Don't push the button. Don't push the button. Horror. I need you to call 911. It doesn't matter. Comedy. Are you hurt? Yeah, not, not since I was 10. Free passes and easy access to the big screen. Every day. How did you burn? No. Be the first to watch the greatest movies on planet Earth. Today's blockbuster is on the magic. This is RBO, your radio box office station. Stop the virus, not the music. Magic 89.9. An old favorite just got better. I get no time. A new sound. Even in my heart. A new vibe. Just hit me with the truth. A new energy. Do you have the time? A new Friday madness. You never said you were pretending. The same gold standard of music. Now, now, in a new package. The nicest of the, the nicest 90s. of the nineties and the early two thousands. Co- coming, coming to you every Friday. Every Friday. 24 hours of yesterday's hits today. Friday Madness. Exclusively on the station that gives you the most complete radio experience. Magic 89.9. Come my lady, come, come my lady. Give my butterfly sugar, baby. Broadcasting live. live. Broadcasting live. Across the Philippines and around the planet. This is the world famous Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. We make your day happier. (laughs) Magic 89.9. The magic brings you closer to the biggest artists. Coldplay. Kanye West. Dua Lipa. Bruno Mars. Showtime. Showtime. 
Harry Styles, Chainsmokers, and more. Somebody scream! We bring you to where it's happening. We are Magic 89.9. From our homes to around the world. It's now, oh, I don't have the time, 7.36. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm sure it was brought to you by Embassy Whiskey. Chill muna tayo. Drink responsively. I could have sworn the first day you went in back in studio, we yelled at you for whispering on uh, <laughs> the show. Um, <laughs> when you open, yeah. back from break, it's best aakit. music. Oh, yeah. yeah. And was that song naturally fading out, or did you fade it out with No, your... it was naturally fading no, out. It, it, it really fades out. Yeah. Ah. Um, anyway, yeah. first I want to say hi to um, Kim Campanilla on her way to her um, law school internship. Good morning to you. Ooh. She's on the road? Kim. Yeah, she's on the road. Now, you told me a little bit, a uh, couple minutes before us getting on the air, that there are no cars on the road. No right cars. Now. I mean, it, it, well, obviously, that's an exaggeration. There are cars, but it is way less than what we usually see at... 7.37 in the morning on a Tuesday. On a Tuesday. Yeah. Because it's coming back. It's coming back. Yeah. Like before, yeah. before. It was before. back. Right. Back. Yeah. Right. 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 Mm-hmm. Though the post-COVID traffic it mm-hmm. was kind of pre-COVID-y, right? But yeah. right now, it is somewhat back to COVID standards. Yeah. And has nothing to do with mm-hmm. the surge in the uh, virus itself, but the surge in gas prices that we've uh, been seeing globally. Um, of course, you guys have been seeing since I drive an electric car. Um, so to flex lang naman. Di ako gumagamit ng gas. But I'm annoying. Oddly enough, for a gray, for a gray tan, that I get to uh, do that. No, okay, so are you guys are scared of gas prices? Is that what it is? Um, uh, Tan, are you scared of gas prices right now? It's <laughs> getting thin. Oh, she's lagging. I think we lost frozen. Oh, gonna, wait. Oh no, my internet. Okay, you're back. You're back. You're back. So, so you guys are terrified okay, of gas prices. Everybody else. No, I'm not. I mean, that's why the streets are somewhat empty. Or what is the? Deal? It's a combination. Uh, yeah. Of what? Of of the COVID surge and the gas prices, and that's why people aren't going out. It's back. It's really. It's truly back. It's. Mm. I have so many friends that are positive. Same. And everyone's scared again to go out. Yeah. But you guys are not I really. Think it's actually more that more the COVID surge than the gas surge because. Major, Ilang, ilang weeks na siyang tumataas eh. Diba? Medyo pinnacle ngayon. Pero... Yeah, tapos parang pa, palapit ng palapit ulit. Parang before, the same story. Mm-hmm. Palapit ng palapit yung virus. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, I, I think about gasoline and I think about COVID and I remember when Digong said to dip your mask in gasoline. Oh my God. Yes. Uh, sanitizing. Just in fact, uh... Oh man, I miss him. Those were the good old days of COVID. <laughs> I miss him now. Really I miss him already. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? Uh, it, his daughter it, was inaugurated yesterday, yes. which is super yeah. early, uh, right? Yeah. I thought they were supposed to be kind of a team. In yeah. Yeah. Of yeah. On the 30th, but yeah. that bad. And you, he looked really upset. The dad looked so upset oh, at the inauguration. Yeah, he looked so sad. As in, he looked the whole time. He looked like he was in the picture. So he looked upset. His pores were a little bit deeper. And his... <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Um, Ryan, you were saying that there is like we just as we kind of talk about stuff in the news since we've been kind of gone, but there is an online push to save tropical hut. Yes, yes tropical oh, hut. Yeah. yeah, I think a lot of pictures went viral of like tropical hut not having any customers. Like like people posting now, I'm the only customer here. Come here and like let's save this this restaurant that's been going on in the Philippines for like since like the seventies, even earlier. Yeah, Tropical has been around for a very yeah. long time. <laughs> it is not a delicious burger. See, that's the problem. Um, <laughs> hey, uh, it isn't. It hey, is. Come yeah. on, guys. See, this is this falls <laughs> under my chocnut thing, which is nostalgic. Yes. Do you remember a a, a beautiful childhood? Yes. Tropical Hut is a big part of that. It is a big part of mine. It's not a good burger. Hey, and and as competition it. gets, as burgers get better and competition gets, you know, obviously with the quality, so it's the competition's tighter, an inferior burger is going to die. I can't, I can't say, because I, I think I haven't tried Tropical Hot. Alam mo, parang ako din. Ever? Parang ako din. Ever. It's good. It's, I, it doesn't taste it's as, good. as fast food. I, I mean, compared to like the other burger chains, it doesn't taste as like processed. I would say. What? Yeah. I mean, like, like, compared to, like, 
you know, you know like you will drive through and and the patty's like this thin, like it's super thin, and it tastes really really processed. The tropical hot one's like a, a little thicker. Um, you can really taste it. Like it's it's not like amazing, but for for a fast food burger, I think it's good. For its price, also. Oh, for its price, Oh, then why is it going out of business? If it's a good burger at a cheap cost, this is this is that that isn't that like the business perfect, you know, marriage. I can give you something good. I can charge you not too much. I mean, if you're a consumer, you're like, yes, this is what I want. I think if it's it marketing. Like burger, why yeah, is it I agree. I think it's marketing. I think it's marketing. They don't like, have we see, we see ads for other yeah. stuff all the time, like on our on YouTube ads, like here on the radio, we say them. But I've never ever seen a tropical it. hat in my life. Tropical hat had a mo- had a time, right? Let's say seventies, eighties, nineties. I, I didn't see any YouTube ads for it back then. It was doing fine. Yeah, 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 YouTube, oh. none. Yeah, and it, it, it didn't have any competition before. That's why. So it's not marketing. Yeah, I think ah. it's not a good burger. Mm. You know what? I, what I'm gonna do today is I uh, know. Or there are nung and and then I'll check. Right, I'll, how I'll about give you this? Eight six three one zero eight nine nine. Five one. Why is Tropical Hut dying? Do you think? <laughs> why is Tropical Hut not doing well? Is it a delicious burger? Because it is not a delicious burger. I had it a hundred times. But okay, hindi ba nung yan eighties, nineties, whatever? Wala rin namang YouTube ads yung big fast food companies eh. So hindi ba nagkakaroon ng sila? I, I, obviously, I'm kind of kidding about that because it's obvious that there were no online ads. Eighties, <laughs> no. But it was never marketed in the same. Didn't have the machinery that McDonald's had mm-hmm. or John had. It never did. Yeah. Why is it dying now? That's a question. We get some calls here. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine. Tropical Hut. R I P. Baby. It's time. Oh my gosh! No, Burger they're stock. resurrected. Yeah. Na yeah. Morning. I'm sure. I'm sure the pandemic Morning. didn't help. Did you lose them? Oh man. Okay. All right, yeah, guys. Try giving us a call back. Uh, and don't blame it on the gas prices, by the way. Why I'm talking about this. <laughs> Sorry, you were saying. Go ahead. What? Yeah, I blame. I would. I'd say the pandemic really didn't help them. Yeah, because why not? Selling online presence. Just big lumalala yeah. paying physical presence. Oh, yeah. Too much on this online. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Hey. Yeah, you, uh, yeah uh, just to answer your question, why I think Tropical Hot never really made it to the big leagues or why is it mm-hmm. dying? Uh, probably because of the ambience of their restaurant, their chains. Uh, parang ano eh, parang, parang ang dumi. Mm, that's actually you, true. Uh, and yeah, their yeah. branch. Okay, wait, can I, can I tell you, officer? I only know Tropical Hut as if it was a kiosk. I've never been into Tropical Hut, a a branch. A restaurant. It's yeah, always there. been just like a vehicle, <laughs> a big truck, and then you walk up into it, and there was no air, you know, there's no seating area. I mean, there is, but it was outdoor. But that was my Tropical Hut experience, not. Yeah, yeah. and uh, yeah. drive through. And like, oh, yeah. oh, and oh, oh, great spot, mo. yeah. Galing sorry, mo. sorry. Does does any of the big lechon places like Baliwag and Docks, all these, do those still exist? Yes, 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 yes. 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 Mm. Do they have drive through? No, <laughs> they do no. not. But, but they, do they don't have... compete with the uh, other burger places. Like oh, that's oh, a different experience. Dine-in. Yeah, diba? yeah, it's more like yun, parang kiosk. The only like, dine-in I know of, ano, na mga chicken, chicken is in Boracay. And Docks, Boracay. Mm. Yeah, and Docks, Boracay. Mm. I put Tropical Hut right up there. No, fine, it's not burger per se, but come on. I mean, McDonald's is chicken. Charlie's got chicken. But you know what? Like, it's, it's not just burgers. But they like aircon, right? I mean, these undocks places, they're just like literal na open. Like literal box. And that's yeah. what Tropical Take Hut has always lang. been for me, though. Oh. You know what? No, no, it's not like that. So, it's more like yeah. typical burger places. Wow, I've never seen a table before in Tropical Hut. Good morning. But again, I'm a province kid, right? Oh, we lost it. Eight, eight, nine, nine. Why is Tropical Hut dying? And really, do you want it to survive? Or, I, I mean, is the online push a short-lived? Well, that trend lang yan. If they don't adjust, yeah, like, if they don't only really care now, yeah. Yeah. yeah, they'll be gone. See, everybody's everybody's gonna buy a color TV. We're like, okay, let's save the black and white TV. Then some guy's gonna buy it. <laughs> it's stupid. What's gonna What's gonna happen is they're gonna have this big surge of customers. They're gonna be hiring people to ano uh, to work, oh and then gosh, bigama that. wala, and then they'd have to let oh, people no. off again. <laughs> Please. It's a very Hi. sad part. Uh, hey, please. good morning. Not that sad, guys. Hi. Hey, morning. what's up? Good morning. Uh, well, I think the Tropical Hot because never naman made an effort to improve their marketing. So they never mm-hmm. made an effort to like adapt to new marketing stuff. 
So yun, and then and then the allegations are tago then. So yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, all right. Thanks for the call. Appreciate you. Thank you. These are our listeners who turn red at the beach. Yeah, I mean, Tago is because... They're not in the prime I mean, spot. Pr- um, the only The only tropical hot I know is in uh, FTI, Food Terminal, in the Alabang. There's one in, in Green Hills. Mm-mm. There's one in Green Hills. And then there's one. Tropical Parang half grocery siya. Okay, go. See. Good morning. Our lines are full. 863 Let's take another call here. Hey, good morning. Should we bury. Hello, good morning. Can we all attend the tropical funeral bury? and just. Hello, good morning. Just, Hello, good morning. Just, Hello. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Hi. Think of the good Hi. News. I think Hi. you got this wrong with uh, Tropical Hot having a kiosk. Inside the gas station, I think that's Burger Machine. Tropical Hut has a business of a restaurant and a grocery. Yes, a grocery. No, I'm talking about. I'm talking about me. My experience. I remember Tropical Hut and Burger Machine uh, vividly, and mine. My Tropical Hut experience was never. But again, this is growing up in the province in the early 90s. Oh, yeah, okay, I okay. Yeah, I don't anyway, have... Anyway, I, I think Tropical Hut didn't really take off because they haven't changed anything with their menu. And then they haven't really improved their stores. And then they have a few branches left in Metro Manila. What do you mean improve their stores? Uh, they haven't improved their, their facade, everything. Mm-hmm. They haven't the changed with the time. Mm-hmm. Were, they, were they the target? Was the target market of Tropical Hut, you guys, who, who requested the facade? Be somewhat uh, <laughs> high level. <laughs> yeah. My waterfall, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I, 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 I'm wishing well. <laughs> jumping ball area. In, in any it. business, you have to um, improve a little and change a yeah, little. Yeah. I, I agree with uh, that. Like yeah. I mean, I agree that. Okay. Okay. Uh, Better uh, the uh, tropical hot has the pine of mini carousel inside. Yes. Diba? May mga uh, yeah. 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 Oh. May pa amusement park effect. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, no, okay, hold on, I've got a question. Is Burger Machine dead? I mean, have we no, very that? Very no, strong. No, no, very strong. Okay, well, yeah. Mega alive. Burger Machine, yeah, your days are numbered. <laughs> 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 Thanks for the call. Thank, right, thank you. Burger, Burger Machine looking at travel going, oh, goddamn. Jesus, here we go. Uh, 8631 um, There's an online push to save yeah, Shopper. Yeah. People are flocking to the branches left. And they're not actually going. They're all ordering via ordering Grab. Grab. Yeah, via yeah. Grab. <laughs> Konti you know. lang yung pumuputa talaga. So if you go now, it's all... Oh, no. Okay. Morning. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Hey. Oops. Hey. Hang on. Let's take another one here. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Lines are full, so uh, take care of this here, everybody. Okay. Radio, please. I think uh, it's because they don't have a um, specialty or a slogan. Unlike Jollibee. Okay. Have, uh, I like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Joy. Or so marketing there. Ah, oh, uh, that wala sila. Uh, boosted their presence in the early '90s. I think there's really mm-hmm. no, I don't know, signature something that not yeah, people have. Yeah, yeah. Smart. And I, yeah. No, I don't know if that's marketing. Yeah, it's really menu, right? The men, they didn't have anything in the menu that would compete with these foundation items oh, that like a challenge you know, or yeah, yeah. Right? Oh, yeah the big, mac. big mac, big mac, mm-hmm. right? yeah, yeah, the chicken yeah. buckets, you know, things like that. Okay, true, I like true. that. That's good enough. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you for the call. Thank you, sir. Morning, guys. Thank you. Morning. Morning. And and back in the day, in its in its prime, the selection was so few that it can survive without a signature mm-hmm. piece. Now that yeah. we've seen so much more variety, it's kind of like those old school. And I don't know if you guys know this because all of you guys seem to have come from some money. But <laughs> when when we were younger, you can get a pizza. That looked nothing like a pizza. It looked honestly like a drawing of a pizza. <laughs> and uh-huh. that's what you would eat. And it was shit house. And yeah. we were mm. fired because there was no other competition. Now, of course, Pizza Hut was there and Shakey's was there. But you went there if it was a birthday. The regular just pizza that you find kind of on the corner yes. in their mm-hmm. guys and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Those is what you ate. And, and I, I put that in the Burger Machine Tropical Hut range. It's like it's a shit burger. That was available at the time, but now that the competition is vast and even variety for all people from different economic and social classes, it, mm-hmm. it's a crappy burger. Okay, 
I don't think Tropical Hut is cheap though. Like I, I wouldn't put it in the same league as Burger Machine. Like Burger Machine's like buy one take one. It's like cardboard thin. Yeah. Tropical Hut's a bit like juicier. Boy, you're really selling this. See how I know, right? Ryan. How are you? Tropical. You're, you're a Tropical Hut Avenger. I go to all these other <laughs> major, uh, you know, fast food restaurants, and the the burgers paper thin. But oh, Tropical Hut's juicier. 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 Hello. Hey, good morning. Hi, guys. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Hi, um, good morning. Yeah, I, I used to go to Tropical Hut near Queen Supermarket somewhere along mm-hmm. Marcos Highway for many years. Mm-hmm. Um, and we actually liked it. Um, I think we should all taste it again if uh, we, you know, we tasted it before and haven't tried it for the longest time. And you guys, if you haven't tried it ever before, I think we should try it. It's, I remember it to be a good burger. Not an amazing burger, but a good burger. It's <laughs> priced really affordably. And I think what mm-hmm. happened is like over the years, um, you know, it, it's lost its relevance to, to the target market because one, you know, they never really improved, you know, their stores. They never really improved their menu. Um, mm-hmm. And they never really did any... Oh. Hello. Oh. Oh. No. Yeah. Hi, I'm still here. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah, so, I mean, versus Jollibee and... McDonald's have obviously, um, you know, um, marketed their products, uh, change, you know, their um, positioning d- depending on the target market, and mm-hmm. um, you know, it's big. Be- you know, maybe, maybe I'm, maybe I'm wrong about this whole marketing thing. I, I still can't agree yet. Okay, that it is marketing. I but- think it's product. Um, and marketing, like it's a combination of a lot of things. Yeah, like, it has to be. I feel like Tropical Hut needs a face, like a, like a spokesperson, like some celebrity to be like, you know, oh, like, I know, I'm yeah, a yeah, picture yeah, of yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never be McDonald's. Hut. Yeah, you'll never be McDonald's because McDonald's is a global powerhouse. Yeah, yeah. 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 Jollibee, it's, it's it not good to compare it to Jollibee or right. McDonald's. Jollibee mm. now is a powerhouse. No, I want to say global. Mm. I want to say global powerhouse, but like there. So, who do you think is a local yeah. competitor of Tropical Hut? Burger Machine. That for burger, me. burger Machine. But oh, the yeah, Burger no. Machine is parang the competition of Burger Machine is Angels. Angels. Yeah. Mga ganon. I don't know. I, I, I put it in the Burger Machine League. I could be wrong. I but I that's that's what I recall it as. Um eight six three one three eight nine nine by the way is our uh, phone number to call and get yourself on the show. Oh, lines. Hey good morning. Oh, lines. Okay, let's let's grab another one. Hello? Hello? Hello, yes, hi. you are on. Yes, hi. Um yeah, I think morning. I agree with the other callers. It's going to be the marketing because they, they didn't really evolve. Um, I, I would put it, you know, the same with what happened with uh, Windows when they didn't evolve. It, it, you know, they're, they're, mm. they're, they're, they're decreasing. Right now, it, like, their their place is not really that good. Um, with, with the era of, you know, the, the kids are looking for something that's Instagrammable, um, it, it could add up to to their market, so I, I think that's that's mm-hmm. it. They're they're not improving. They just you know they're just stagnant. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep. Yes. Now, now, if if we put, you know, you said it was Windows again. Mm-hmm. Windows, though, global powerhouse product. Okay, uh, Tropical Hot is if we use the Cola Wars. And you you throw out your Coke and you you throw out there your Pepsi's and then you know Sprite, mm-hmm. Seven all that stuff. Um. Those are global juggernauts of, of so- soda. What would be the true Tropical Hut equivalent, though, in a soda war? It, would it be your RC Cola? RC. 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 Sparkle. Cola, probably. Pop Cola. Those mm. die. Right, they're they're meant to <laughs> at some point die off, while Coke face. and Pepsi will always mm-hmm. be there. Although although RC had a big push because of their commercial, yeah, the viral one. Right. Yes, yeah. I agree. Right. But just like Pepsi, they already died. Those are meant to die at some point. Because <laughs> hmm. they're gonna lose to another no, no, Coke, and yeah, they'll lose to the Pepsi. Good morning, Pepsi. And Pepsi is the best. Okay, thanks for the call. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. 30 Veras uh, tweeted right now. He said, um, 
He believes that uh, Chapel Cut was the one who introduced the uh, pineapple into the burger, even beating pizza by 10 years. Oh, yeah. Whoa. It, and that contributed to it being a shitty ass burger. <laughs> okay, um, one of my friends say it, it's not um, tropical hot. Tropical hot isn't cheap, and they take forever to order anything because wala nang tao, so walang ready made. Mm-mm. Mm. Uh, I, yeah. Call it to be cheap. Call it to be cheap. Oh, wait, let me check out the. Yeah. Boy, I got a big vacuum going on, so we got all this construction going in the background. But I uh, apologize for that. Eight six three one three eight nine nine is the um, phone number if you want to call us. Hello. Hey, good morning. Hi. Hello. No, you're not there. Hello. Hey, yes, hello. I hear you. Hi. Hey, good morning. So, ayan. So, follow up ko lang dun sa mga sinasabi nila. Yeah. Uh, Imperium ng restaurant is really bad. So, flooring literally parang tanyo bahil. Uh, oh, no. Hindi nyo kumakain ka parang sa bahil. Kasi yung ganun yung tiles ng flooring nila. So, Fact. Imperium would be, you know, a lot of improvement. And, yeah, hindi naman siya ganun kasarap, honestly. It's a good burger. That's an amazing burger. So, Yeah, that's what everyone's saying. Yeah. So, yeah, that's my that's good take, I think, para maging... Ano ba siya? Siya ba yung burger na masarap pagutom ka? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't that <laughs> every... <laughs> I'm starving. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm looking at their uh, prices. Totoo ah, hindi nga siya. Hindi siya mura. Yeah, how much is their burger? So, a clubhouse is 163. Oh, that's... Not, yeah. Um, A cheese... Dog is 71. It's breakfast there, eh, so walang lumalabas ng burgers. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> so, pa- ka price ng Jolly A regular pala. cheeseburger is 66. The one with the egg that everyone seems to love, their rancho ranchero, is 121. Their double burger is 181. Damn. Their solo cheeseburger is 93. The one with the the the... Um, pineapple that you you were talking about 121 uh, so okay, let's compare huh? let's might see. as well just take your 121 and light it on fire stop <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see let's see that <clears throat> pineapple oh my god what a crime <laughs> are you mas like, mura si, mas, ma, mas mahal sila sa ano Jollibee huh? Jollibee oh, wow. yeah the amazing yeah. Aloha champ which also has the pineapple is 109. Oh wow. That's like a 70 yeah. pesos difference, right? If I remember correctly. Yeah, okay, okay. It's a 121. Is, it, is that is that the reason for their death then? Is it that yeah. the rich people are like, "Hello, I might as well just go to a better place." And then like with those who are not as well, they're like, "Okay, we raise prices on us." Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. I mean, like, yeah, it, it, but <laughs> It's not. It's not a nice. It's not cheap. Yeah. Double whatever, yeah. Mas mas mahal kasi sa double whatever ng Jollibee. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, there's, there's probably a correlation between the rise of Jollibee and the fall of Tropical Hut, right? Like maybe oh, there's only room for one. Like, fast, Filipino fast food. I don't. I don't, uh, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that at all. No way. Jollibee no way. is the lead. Ah, alam ko lang bakit. No, no, no. But not before. No, ever since. Mm. Ever since. I mean, at Agamulak was there. Was there? In mm. prime Aga years, he was their spokesperson. That costs, you know, that's a major get for for mm. Jolly. Was there ever a, a tropical hut commercial? Para wala ako I don't remember. But how we were Abu Barnet? Yeah, probably like Kuya Germs or something like that. I mean, <laughs> an ass like endorser. Morning. <laughs> hey, good. <laughs> What was that? It was an automatic hey. sensor. Hello. Hey, good morning. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hi. Good morning. Hello. Hi. Yes. Hi. Hi, good morning. Still the tropical hot topic? Yes. Yeah, yes, ma'am. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, I just wanna say, uh, ano nga, as far as I remember, yung tropical hot yata, nung kinder ako, isa lang yung nalabas nilang radio ad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tapos ano pa siya, nung before, like, I was kinder, I remember they sponsored lang a movie, like yung Baguettes. It was mentioned on the logo. If you're a fan of, ano, watching old movies before, you're gonna yeah, see yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. After nun, wala. Hmm. So okay, so that. this push, having said all that and, and all of your calls really, this push to save it, why is there energy behind it? Why can't we just go, this is your fault? <laughs> <laughs> If you've been buying from before, you wouldn't have to do this. Exactly. Yeah. Like your your yeah. sucks, your, so cool. your prices are outrageous. And you didn't care. 
Why are we? Why, why? Why are we now coming to your rescue? You deserve it. That's a good question. Why are we? I yeah, see, nostalgia yeah. factor. Nostalgia. Yeah. Hey, this is, this will go on brand, until right? end of end of June and the Pride Month lang yan, and then what we'll mm-hmm. What does this have to do with Pride Month? I'm no, I mean it's only the end of June. Dog or what? Well, like sixty pesos. The sixty pesos she's dog. <laughs> 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 one, uh, Elijah, full, maybe one, one or two more, and then that's it. We can done here. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Hi. Hi. <laughs> um, siguro yung yung isang family member of the of, of the owner of Tropical Hut, merong wild idea na maybe we can use socials on on, on to push the marketing thing. They don't have the budget to, you know, uh, get an ambassador or or create. A, a, oh, it was a, 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 eh. it was a stranger's tweet, eh. Na parang um, she ordered random. random, ano, tapos shinare niya. And then, well, nowadays, anyone can be a random Twitter. Uh, I don't know. Diba? Because yeah. Tropical Hut never upgraded their facilities. Uh, it's not appealing. They they use a color that's not, you know, uh, very appealing to, to dine. And then the prices yeah. are really high. Hindi naman talaga siya affordable. Plus, local burger stands are... Uh, ba to? They have promos, diba? So, angels, lahat. May buy one, take one. Tapos yung mga, yung mga bagong uh, names, like yung, yung Zarks, diba? They offer new choices mm. or options. Right. Yet, buy one pineapple, get one more that. slice for free. They <laughs> should have done that. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, man. No. Thank no, you. No Great call. Bye. 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 <sighs> I'm done with this. this. I'm done with this too. I'm done with this too. Yeah. That's burger, burger, burger machine, but when you burp, it's the, the one that parang, parang longanese, it stays with you. Yes. Is that Trump? Which, one, which, one, which one was it? Burger machine? I think there's one of them that like, burp. Oh my gosh. I think it's burger machine. Yeah, probably. Dude, burger machine's pretty ass too. Oh yeah. It, yeah. Terrible. Let's real talk this. <laughs> Actually, any of the burger kiosks. I don't every lahat naman. Your ass. Yeah. I'm okay with angels though. I've I have, never. I haven't tried angels. I, I, never, I, I give. I give. I give their pizza a try also. We ordered in two. So yeah. That's Angel. different. I think that's that's a different. Oh yeah, okay, bayon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, lord. Speaking of things, I tried the good. angels pizza also. That even finished like three two slices. Speaking of things that are no longer good, Matt says, loved your morning show during Mojo and Grace days. Nico and KC, but this man, current one, is the worst. Um, <laughs> Miko. I uh, love the Miko days. Uh, because we're at home. We're on Zoom. The energy isn't there. What are you going to do? It's a freaking stupid virus. Sucks. Uh, but yes, maybe we go down the tropical hot day uh, road as well. Uh, we'll take a break. When we come back, we'll have more of the show. Back after this, don't go. An old favorite just got better. I get no A new sound. Even in my heart. A new vibe. Just hit me with the truth. A new energy. Do you have the time? A new Friday night. Never said you were pretending. The same gold standard of music. Now, now, in a new package. The nicest of the, the nicest 90s. of the nineties and the early two thousands. Co- coming, coming to you every Friday. Every Friday. Twenty four hours of yesterday's hits today. Friday madness. Exclusively on the station that gives you the most complete radio experience. Magic eighty nine point nine. Come, my lady, come, come, my lady, you're my butterfly. Sugar. Broadcasting live across the Philippines and around the planet. This is the world famous Magic 89.9. Home of today's best music. Today's best music. The best music ever. The best music ever. On air, online, and on ground. Are you ready? The black and yellow microphone is on. Music. Magic 89.9. We make your day happier. <laughs> Magic 89.9. The Magic brings you closer to the biggest artists. Coldplay. Kanye West. Dua Lipa. 
Bruno Mars. Harry Styles, Chainsmokers, and more. Somebody scream! We bring you to where it's happening. We are Magic 89.9. From our homes to around the world, this is Magic 89.9. Amazing. The Magic Pop 30. We count down the 30 hottest songs of the week. Find out which artists that are lit AF. AF. As Zoe and Ashley count it down from 30 to 1. The Magic Pop 30. Are you ready? Now on its new time slot. Thursdays, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. On today's best music. Magic 89.9. Magic 89.9. The seats you want for the movies you love. This is Sparta! Action. Right. I am Iron Man. Drama. She was more real than anything I've ever known. Suspense. Don't push the button. Don't push the button. Horror. I need you to call 911. It doesn't matter. 